Well, National Geographic has spent 120 years caring about this planet, and as you all know, our mission is to inspire people to care about the planet. Does it bring disrespect to our family? Is it what you want, Bobby? Going against the family? Let's not leave you here. Next time I'll be your face, Bob. Hey, I gave you. So there's no question that this organization, uh, through its media, in a significant way, just raising the awareness of people, whether it's through our television programming. Bonnie. Please get off the car. Get off the car. Oh, no, you will get paid. Get off your car. On the opportunity, so I have to get here. Get off the car. Right, right there. On the ground. One more stomach. All the way down. All the way down. I want to cross on you when I win. Unclench that fist now. Do it. Put your hand behind your back. Put your hand behind your back. Put your hand behind your back. Behind your back, do it now. Taser, taser, taser. Ah. Put your hand behind your back, do it now. Put your hand behind your back. Get your hand behind your back. You will get tased again if you do not put your hand behind your back. Thank you. There you go. You want me to kick you? Hey, you kick me. Don't. <laughs> well, well, then what do you want? Do you uh, or whether it's through what we do with uh, in the magazine, uh, stories about climate change, stories about energy. I think uh, more recently we've really hit on some of these uh, important topics in a significant way. I killed two people. They gave me a capital life sentence, 35 years flat in prison. This is the bottom. This is where all the violence is. This is where things get rough. When I pulled up onto the Styles unit, they put me in the cell block with a bunch of racist gang members. It's a bad situation. It's your rank, kid. And I said, what are you talking about? Hey, man, I'm not in your gang. Yes, man. I'm not a racist. Well, you better move, kid, or you're a dead man. SOS! 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 At that point, I knew SOS! it's SOS on you, dog. Stab on sight. My life expectancy could be very short. And our intent here is not to tell people that you ought to be thinking this way about something, but it's just to bring some light to the facts. I've got five kilos strapped on my back. Anything going wrong now means you're inside. This is kamikaze work. I was addicted to it. I was suddenly surrounded by armed police. I'm a martial artist. Now it's life-saving time. And when we do that, we think we'll raise the consciousness and we'll have uh, better informed uh, people who will make wiser decisions themselves and encourage others, including policymakers, to make wiser decisions. That would go well. When a loved one finds sex outside the relationship, for most couples, this is betrayal and a taboo. But not to this couple, Dino and Holly. <laughs> Today, Dino answers a knock at the door. Hi, you must be Deke. That's me. Dino, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. A stranger has arrived to have sex with Holly. Good, how are you? Seeing you. So I think this institution, almost every single day, 
is uh, doing very, very much to uh, uh, get people to really think about the implications of the things they do as it relates to this planet. A woman rushes police. When they're drinking, all judgment goes out the window. Unable to pacify her or her husband, police have no choice but to arrest them.